So happening right now, the trial of a Colorado officer accused of putting a handcuffed woman inside a police car while it was parked on train tracks. The woman was severely injured when a freight train slammed into the vehicle and the crash was caught on camera. We do want to warn you, this video might be disturbing. Kana Whitworth has day one of that trial. This morning, the officer accused of placing a handcuffed female suspect in the back of a patrol car moments before a freight train plowed into it is standing trial. Police body and dash cameras capturing the horrifying crash. At the time, she elected to place Yurani Rios Gonzalez in the Platteville patrol car parked on the railroad tracks instead of her own patrol unit that was safely parked to the west of the railroad tracks. Officer Jordan Steinke is facing two charges, felony attempted reckless manslaughter and misdemeanor reckless endangerment. Steinke taking the stand Tuesday, arguing that she did not see any reflective signs or gates indicating a railroad crossing at the time of the incident. It was incredibly dark. I was miles outside of my jurisdiction. I was fairly certain that that particular stop was going to end in a gunfight. I never in a million years thought a train was going to come plowing through my scene. Claiming she would have not put the suspect in the vehicle if she knew it was parked on a railroad. I trusted that Sergeant Vasquez's vehicle was in a secure location at that time. We have to remember that hindsight is 2020. The body cam is going to be so vital because now we can see how much light there was. How far was she? He's getting us medical. The woman who survived the collision, 21-year-old Yurini Rios Gonzalez, was initially arrested and charged with a misdemeanor for an alleged road rage incident back in September. She pled no contest. The edited eight-minute video released by police shows officers pulling her over, one officer parking on the track. Turn around! Put your hands up higher. With guns drawn, police order her to get out, handcuff her, and put her into the back of the cruiser. Ma'am, what's going on? The officers return to search her truck, but then a train can be heard no, approaching. A... The horn finally catching their attention. One officer turns, looks back at the cruiser, and runs. Stay back! Rios Gonzalez hit while still cuffed inside. The car destroyed on impact. Rios Gonzalez sustaining extensive injuries. She has a fractured tibia, um, a broken arm, which she's had surgery on. Uh, she had nine broken ribs. She has a fractured sternum. Rios Gonzalez is also filing a civil complaint, and the Platteville officer who parked on the tracks is also being prosecuted for misdemeanor counts of reckless endangerment. Kana Whitworth, ABC News, Los Angeles.